Hello everyone, girls playoff basketball underway at the start of the postseason. The race to the UIL State Tournament is going to be held once again in San Antonio. Lots of area games. We start in the 4A ranks. Here's the uh, gold ball to go the winner of tonight's game, Perryton Estacado. Uh, Perryton beats the Estacado Press and Sadie Staten is going to get uh, the basket right there. Some nice passing. Later, Perryton on the run. It's uh, Grayson Mosley. And this will be an easy basket for Grayson. Estacado, though, would answer back with a long wire in front of our camera. It's Fabe Dunn. We go to the scoreboard. Uh, Estacado wins by three. Leveland beats Dalhart. Second-ranked Canyon, no problem with Lubbock High. And Emerald High girls, Lady Sandys win again over Montwood. To the 3A ranks, the old WT Fieldhouse. Highland Park taking on Mule Shoe. Highland Park's Addie Patterson finds Jordan Taylor for three. Ah, uh, nothing like the old box, the old Fieldhouse. We heard it was warm in there tonight. Now the handoff for Mule Shoe. Conley Niblet to Yvonne Diaz for the layup. The Highland Park's Jordan Taylor right off. Off on the three, right place, right time. Kristen Elizale puts the easy basket in. Let's go to the scoreboard. Highland Park wins by district. Uh, shallow water gets past River Road, no problem. And it was Dimmitt beating Spearman. To the 2A ranks, fifth ranked team in the state. That would be Panhandle hosting New Deal. You know, you can get a, always get a new deck in New Deal. Uh, first off, uh, Spencer, Krista Spencer for Panhandle. Takes the entry pass, puts it in. Now for New Deal, it's Marcelo Vasquez to Kenzie Johnson for three. And that's pretty good. And then after that, it's uh, Panhandle's Bree Baker, uh, no relation, but she gets the basket, taught her that. Let's go to the scoreboard. Panhandle wins, uh -hoo, easily. Uh, Farwell over Hale Center, one last game, the only one game on the schedule, the Hearts. The day after Valentine's Day, it's Hart and Hartley battling. Hartley's Hunter Hill opens the scoring uh, once we get to the game with a three ball right in front of our camera again. The cameras are in a good spot. Then it's Hart's Lily Ramirez. Watch this, she goes coast to coast all the way down and uh, she runs through every white jersey on the floor and gets the basket on the scoreboard it was Hartley advancing over Hart 46 to 34 by the way a lot more girls games tomorrow night also final night of the boys regular season tonight Childress and Bushland boys won their finales each went unbeaten in the district WT's Michaela Newhouse the LSC offensive player of the weekend the Frank Phillips men beat Midland for their 20th win of the season tonight FPC's having a good year this year. They might make the uh, make a noise in the tournament. No, that'd be cool. Yeah. All right, thank you, Lee. Steve's in after the break.